This is a short clip from today's podcast episode. Do you guys work with realtors at all, Don, on that? Like, um, you know, when they buy a house, they do an inspection, but it's always a piss poor, just a very general inspection. We always recommend that here that our plumbers work with yeah. realtors and show them that, a, you know, a, a camera inspection of the sewer line is vital mm -hmm. before you close escrow. You guys get involved in, in that at all? It's very niche. Mm -hmm. I understand if not. Yeah. Yeah. I tell people all the time and, and we have worked with some realtors doing that. It's hard to get. Realtors, I think a lot of them have a preconceived notion that oh, the home inspector is doing that. We're all good. But it is very, right. very important if you're buying a house to have the sewer inspected and properly inspected by a, by a plumber because I've seen a lot of, of home inspectors now carrying cameras and they'll camera in the sewer. They have no oh. idea what they're looking at. <laughs> and they'll send us reports saying, yeah. this sewer is completely messed That's up. Good... It's about to collapse. And I'll look at it and I'm like, old but there's nothing wrong with it there's <laughs> like wow or vice versa they'll say you know there's nothing wrong with it and i look at it and i'm like you're, you're completely underwater in this 20 foot section and there's something wrong there <laughs> so wow wow yeah that's even more dangerous uh, having them they're not licensed plumbers and they're scoping the line right i'm not sure which is more dangerous not looking at the line at all or having somebody who has no skill set to, to analyze what they're looking at right i'm not sure what's worse but it is, uh, so we've heard some horror stories through our clients, you uh -huh. know, that somebody bought a house and then they got called out to the sewer line and, and then they found out it was broke and it was $22,000. And I'm like, what are you talking about? It just bought the house. So I can only imagine lawsuits involved. Right? Oh, yeah. So now the realtor's getting sued, the other homeowner's getting sued, probably a freaking nightmare. Yeah, because it's impossible to pin back on them that they know for a fact, beyond the shadow of a doubt, that something was wrong with their yeah. sewer or not. And you could have had, you yeah. know, an older, older grandma living there that barely used water in her house. She never had an issue. Right. But now you're moving in with right. a family of four or five. You run a lot more water than she did. You're going to back All up. Right. Yeah. Crazy, crazy. Yeah. There's, so there's a market out there. Not sure realtors as a whole want people potentially sabotaging their transactions so it's uh i don't know you yeah and that's, appeal to the home buyer yeah that's really the you know kind of thing that you have to do as the as a plumber going in with the camera inspection is really just to to do an evaluation on it i'm not here to, to burst anybody's bubble but but a lot of times we do right you know? and and just trying to communicate that in the correct way with the realtors a lot of times is key just letting them know up front look here's the issue that's going on here Here's what we we recommend that needs to be done. Here's the cost for it. And then really from there, especially if they know that going up front, because now they can either one withdraw their yeah, offer yeah. or, you know, put a, a lower offer in to cover the cost of the sewer. Right. And, and a lot yeah, of they people get to negotiate. Correct. Yeah. And and I get that a lot too. We'll go out to camera someone's sewer who's been having backups and they're like, you know, I'm not gonna worry about it. I, I'm just gonna sell the house in a couple of years. Like, okay. Whoa. That's fine, but now it's somebody else's problem. When they when you go to sell the house, if they do their due, due diligence and they look at the sewer line, you're either going to pay for it now or you're going to pay for it later in, in the cost of the sell of the house. So yeah. there's really no sense in putting it off. Absolutely.